Let's talk about a topic that often sparks curiosity, but rarely gets clear, evidence-based answers. The relationship between creatine supplementation and sexual health in men. I'm Dr. Fiona, a sexologist and a urologist, and today, we're going to explore not just the role of creatine in physical performance, but how it may influence hormonal balance, specifically testosterone, and its potential impact on male sexual function. For decades now, creatine has been one of the most widely researched and widely used performance-enhancing supplements in the fitness and sports science communities. Often associated strictly with bodybuilders and athletes, creatine's benefits actually extend far beyond just building muscle mass. Increasingly, clinical data is uncovering its broader impact, from neurological health to possibly even supporting sexual wellness, particularly in aging males. To understand why this matters, let's begin with what creatine actually does in the body. Creatine is a naturally occurring compound synthesized in the liver, kidneys, and pancreas, from amino acids like glycine, arginine, and methionine. Once produced, it's primarily stored in muscle cells in the form of phosphocreatine, where it helps regenerate adenosine triphosphate, or ATP, the primary energy currency of our cells. This energy regeneration is fundamental not only for muscle contraction during intense physical activity, but also for nearly every biological process that requires cellular energy. This is why creatine is so often used to improve high-intensity athletic performance. It works most effectively in short bursts of activity, sprinting, weightlifting, or interval training, where quick energy recovery is critical. In these scenarios, creatine supplementation has shown consistent improvements in muscle strength, endurance, and quicker recovery times. But here's what's truly fascinating. Creatine's role is not limited to skeletal muscle. Recent studies show that it aids cellular energy metabolism in the brain, too. Supplementing with creatine has been linked to enhanced cognitive performance, better neurological recovery post-injury, and even potential benefits in neurodegenerative diseases like Parkinson's or ALS. So it's not just about physical power, it's also brain power. Now, let's look at a lesser discussed but medically significant aspect, male sexual health and testosterone. Many men begin experiencing a natural decline in testosterone levels beginning around the age of 30. This drop can manifest as decreased libido erectile challenges, reduced muscle mass, lower energy levels, and even cognitive fog. Testosterone is a critical androgenic hormone responsible for the regulation of male sexual function. When levels drop significantly, men may experience diminished vitality in both body and mind. Emerging research suggests that creatine may have a role to play in counteracting age-related hormonal decline. In one 10-week randomized controlled trial involving individuals undergoing resistance training, those who supplemented with creatine demonstrated not only superior strength gains, but also a measurable increase in total testosterone levels compared to a placebo group. Another compelling study involving elite male rugby athletes looked at dihydrotestosterone DHT, an even more potent androgen derived from testosterone. After a seven-day high-dose loading phase of 25 grams of creatine daily, the players experienced a dramatic 56% increase in DHT levels. That's notable because DHT is closely affiliated with male libido and sexual performance. While these studies don't establish causation just yet, they do suggest a meaningful correlation worthy of further investigation, especially for men searching for safer, more accessible alternatives to testosterone replacement therapies like injections or patches. In such cases, creatine may offer a supportive role as part of a holistic health and hormone optimization strategy. Now, let's address safety, because that's always a valid concern. The long-term use of creatine was once a controversial subject. Today, however, we have substantial scientific evidence supporting its safety. Clinical trials have followed individuals taking creatine consistently over five years or more without any harmful outcomes on liver or kidney function in healthy individuals. In fact, 
the International Society of Sports Nutrition strongly considers creatine monohydrate to be one of the safest and most effective nutritional supplements available today. Still, it's important to acknowledge that some users may experience mild side effects such as water retention, initial weight gain, or gastrointestinal discomfort. These are typically associated with higher loading phases or additives found in some commercially available supplements. Artificial sweeteners, flavorings, and fillers can contribute to bloating, gas, and other digestive issues. That's why quality matters. When choosing a creatine supplement, it's essential to select one that is pure, third-party tested, and free of additives and contaminants. A pharmaceutical-grade, micronized creatine monohydrate powder unflavored and without unnecessary sweeteners, is often your best bet. In our practice, we often recommend formulations that match these criteria to ensure both safety and efficacy. To conclude, while creatine has long been championed for its sports and workout advantages, the ongoing scientific exploration into its neurocognitive and reproductive health benefits is opening up exciting new conversations. For men experiencing early signs of testosterone decline or looking to enhance both mental and physical vitality, creatine might be a simple, well-tolerated, and evidence-based option worth discussing with a healthcare provider. As always, individual responses vary, and it's important to consider the full scope of your health profile before starting any new supplementation regimen. But the research is clear. Creatine is no longer just a gym supplement it's becoming a powerful tool for holistic male wellness. I'm Dr. Fiona, and this has been your deep dive into the science of creatine and male sexual health. For more insights grounded in research, stay tuned. Because when it comes to optimizing your body and brain, knowledge is power, and we're just getting started.